<laughs> I'm making polkos. I don't, I, I really hate the idea of joining a group order for polkos just because like you can print them at home but like the polka quality overseas is just so good. So I get my polkas from Taobao. Um, I've never tried red printing polkas, but I've like compared my polkas to a lot of my friends who have red printing ones and the quality is like both of them are so good it's like very thick and glossy um so i'm trying to see if i can kind of get that quality in america i want to print these i printed these at fedex but i messed up i'll show you okay so i already went and picked these up because i printed the order i sent the order in last night but i messed it up because um i did it on powerpoint and when you're on my powerpoint or on google slides when you download the slide it downloads in like really small quality which i didn't realize because my paper is set to 8.5 by 11 on powerpoint like my layout so i assumed it would save in that size but it didn't so i'll show you guys how you actually do it but okay so to make them i use my um polka size so my polkas are the same size as red printing so it's 56 by 87 millimeters for the outside box um and on google slides it's only in inches for some reason or i don't know how to change it so it's 2.2 by 3.42 inches those are the <laughs> those are the measurements for the outside box and then for the inside picture you want to make it 1.7 by 2.4 inches and then just do that for all of them and then on google slides you can change the background color over here and you can even make it a, oops, you can even make it a gradient over here. Oh, and make sure your paper, okay, so you want to make sure that your paper is set to, in page setup, make sure it's set to 11 by 8.5 inches. Then you're going to go to download, and don't do this one. Don't do these where it downloads the current slide. You're going to download it as a PDF and save it. And then it should look like this. And this is important, so go to your document properties and check to make sure the page size is correct. It's the one that you're printing at. So basically where I fucked up is this is the original one I printed it at and it looks fine here. Like I saved it as a JPEG from the current slide, but if you go, like it looks good quality here. But if you go to file info, you'll see that it's really small. Like. This isn't the right size, and it's it saved it too small, and there's no option to change the size for some reason. So just save it as a PDF instead. Okay, so upload it as a custom product, and then you're gonna go here to print properties, and then change the laser one to professional white paper, and then gloss cover. And they're 150 a page. Okay, I reprinted them, so I'm back to FedEx. And let's see, reveal. <gasps> okay, they're glossy. They're not as glossy as like I'll show you. <laughs> These are the ones I buy from Taobao. Please. Okay, and these are super glossy, as you can see. This is printed on the gloss paper, so it has a shine to it, but it's not as thick. So I'll have to show the difference. I think this is like 120, maybe 130 pounds. And this is 100 pounds. But it's, it's pretty close. Did I get the size right? My sizing is pretty close. Okay, so this is the first page. Page number two. Number three. There's so much Genshin. <laughs> Page four, and then these are like of me and my friend, Mona, because I just got her. I stopped using a paper cutter because my paper cutter, I swear, cuts crooked. So now I just use like a ruler and a knife. I'm gonna do the rest off camera. Here's all of them a lot of um child because <laughs> i don't know he's so cute i used to think it was really annoying but <laughs> recently i've been really into him and then Yenfei, of course my favorite 
this one is Shanks, a fan art of Shanks. Um, Chainsaw Man, More Child, oh my god. Guys, this is embarrassing, this is like simp behavior. Oh my god, oh my god. Well, let's stop. <laughs> this one is the manga I fell in love after school because I read it recently and I really liked it. Sabo and Ace. And then Power. I love Power. So this stack of Polkos cost me $6. Okay, I'm going to do these two first. The holofilm is from my shop, from my Instagram. So if you want to use the same one as me, you should check out my website or my Instagram. And then to apply it, basically you just pull it back and make a tab like this. <gasps> just try not to touch it. Okay, I think I'm gonna do a rose border, the blue ones. I'm actually not a huge fan of Suong's roses because I think they're like too fat. Like, I like, whose roses do I like? I really like one of this, this is roses um, because they're like skinny and they have leaves separately so you can kind of customize the shape of things more. Not to say that like Suong's roses are bad. recently started playing a lot of Genshin. I made my account so long ago. Like I think I made it in September of 2020. So I've been I've had my account for a while, but it wasn't that, as big at the in in September like last year. I feel like now I feel like it's just so big and it's more fun now because I know more people that play now whereas before I was kind of just playing on my own. Um, so like, I made my account so long ago, but I never used it, because I stopped playing, and I, like, saw all the banners when they were coming out, like, Zhongli and Child's banner, but like, I didn't care enough to go try for any of them, so I missed all of them, and the reruns, and I was so sad, because now that I'm playing a lot, I really wish I had them, and it's like, other people, I know a lot of, like, my friends don't have them because they, like, didn't play during their banner. But I literally played. Like, I literally, I just, like, was too lazy to go try. But. I'm really confused. <laughs> I'm really, I don't have good artifacts. Like, okay, next. These are Hazu illustration bears. I can go underneath this. Maybe a rainbow under this rose. These are my favorite stickers from Daiso. I think a lot of Daiso stickers aren't that good for Deco. But this one I love. My like, dice just continue them or they stopped stocking them. So I asked someone from California to buy them for me. And I'm super grateful because I love these. And then my favorite stickers right now are these by Noni Noni Studio. I really like adding these. I think they're so cute. And they're really like they pair very well with everything. Okay, that's it for this one. And then now let's do Scaramouche. Is that a big sticker here? Ooh, I do not like how that looks. <laughs> never mind. Okay, never mind, never mind. Um, so I want to use, I just got these new stickers. I want to theme it around this one. So like, 
These are from uh, Love Me More. So this one and this Poop Mom one is really, really cute. I think they go well together. And then... This is the one of this rose I was talking about. Let's add some leaves. These are so thin. I think Love Me More has some of the most unique stickers. I feel like these days, I don't really like buying Suong because like, everyone's deco posts use the same stickers and just i feel like i'm getting bored because they all look the same everything i make so recently i've been like very picky about the stickers i buy for example i really don't like bear stickers like it's not that i don't like bears because they're cute but like there's only so many bear stickers i can own this tassel this tassel <gasps> look it even has like a little cut in it which is so cute i'm really excited for scaramouche's banner i saw like the model the leak of the model and he looks so good okay, i know he's 5'2 whatever short king but like i really like his character design i love the hat i want to use up the one of this sheet. What are these? These are like oh they're fairies. Oh my god, that's so cute. Yeah, I think Poopinum also has really cute stickers. I love their sword sticker sheet. It has like swords and roses, I think. What's this one? I think so, right? Okay. Okay, done. Cute. Few moments later. Okay, guys, I finished most of them. I only have five left. Like, I was like, I don't know. I just sat down and I like slaved over these polkas, but it was worth it because I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you guys all of them. And also, because I'm moving soon, I just know my attention span is so bad. Like, if I don't finish these all at once, like, I'm gonna spend time doing it tomorrow. And, like, like instead of being actually productive and doing, like, actual stuff I need to do, like, instead of packing, uh, I feel like I'm gonna end up decoying. <gasps> Look how thick it is. This one's Nami. Dilig and Traveler. I'm gonna try to put the Twitters of where the fan art is from. There's a lot of Child and Dilug and like there's a lot of Genshin characters specifically because I'm pen paling, uh, like my pen pals really like Genshin too, so I, I decided to make them some. This one is me and Isabel. I'm gonna give it to her. But look, this one's Kaya. Look, these are my favorite stickers right now, the Nyoni Nyoni Studio ones. And I have snowflake stickers, and I was, I'm trying to get rid of them because I feel like I won't really use them until Christmas. So, this one is another child one. I think I'm gonna keep this one for myself just because this one's like really sticker heavy. These are Nevertheless Waves, and they just fit so well because you know, he's like Hydra Vision. Another child one. This one is for my pen pal. And like it's so perfect because I have these cat clear stickers. This one is Jong Lee. And then he's just yellow. <laughs> Another one. This is by the same artist that did the D Luke and Traveler one. Another child one. This song has been stuck in my head all day. Griffin's version of Rasputin. Like it's always on my free page, so now it's stuck in my head. This one is also for my pen pal. It's D. Luke and Kaya. I really want them just to be happy again. Oh, Kaya probably has my favorite story. This one is Shanks from One Piece. I found this artist on Twitter and I love their art so much. Yanfei. 
I'm a Yen Fei main right now, so, you know, I feel This is more, um, Zhong Li and Child, but this time they're together. <gasps> this one is my favorite one I made. Look, I love this so much. This is the Buxel, um, Devil sticker, the Lucifer sticker sheet with Shocking Pink Rose. Hitsan. This is Tasha from Witch Hunter, which is one of my favorite series. I recently reread it and I forgot how much I liked it. Mona. I lost my 50 50 to Mona, and I'm trying to stop being upset over it. So, this is for her. I really liked her story quest though. More Hitsan. This is his dream show selfie. This is I Fell in Love After School which is a shoujo manga I recently read, and if you, it's very similar to Namai Kizakari. So if you like that, you'll probably like this. This is um, Child and Teaser. I don't know if I'm saying that correctly, but yeah. This one's Scaramouche because I'm really excited for his banner and I love his hat. And then this is the one we made, I showed me making. This one is Denji and Power. I read Chainsaw Man like last month, and I liked it. I was kind of really confused, but I still, I really enjoyed the art. And I really like power, too. Sabo and Ace. I really like One Piece. Like, I really enjoy reading the manga. Like, you can shit on me for that, but like, I genuinely really enjoy it. This is another Chainsaw Man one. This is Power. My friend gave me these Shocking Pink Rose stickers, the blood ones. She's, um, she's a Shocking Pink Rose rep, so. And then this is the last one. This is Hitchan. This is his selfie from uh, Hot Sauce. Oh my god, I kind of- can you see his devil horns? It's so cute. I just took Instagram photos. The cookbook I have in my bulkos is the Love Things one. And now they're all safe and sound. It's a quick flip through. This one, this is my favorite one, so it's gonna be on display. Hey! I'm, I don't know why, I just love this one so much.